shit. This could have gone better. He wasn't supposed to die, man, and his wife's gonna be home any minute. Fuck, man, we are fucked. Be cool, man. Be cool. We got a cleaner on the way right now. A cleaner? Yeah, a cleaner. Fixes messes like this one. Must be him. Somebody call a cleaner? <laughs> oh, yeah. Real mess. Real amateur work, boys. All right. Now, if I'm right, the wife gets home at 3.30, which gives us 30 minutes to get out of Dodge. But if you do what I say when I say it, that should be plenty of time. Is that cool with you, boy? Yeah. All right, why don't you cool down? I'm gonna get to work. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what are you doing? Jerking off the dead guy. What do you think I'm doing? <laughs> Why? Autoerotic asphyxiation. Nobody asks any questions. What? <laughs> Listen, all right? I don't have time to answer your bullshit questions, all right? But imagine, you know, imagine you're his wife, and you come home to find your dear old husband dead. He's been jerking it and strangling himself all day. <laughs> You're not going to want to get the whole neighborhood involved. <laughs> no. <laughs> Things like this go real quiet. <laughs> Wait, is this good for real? Be cool, man. Be cool. If you know what's good for you, you'll listen to your partner and shut the fuck up. <laughs> well, uh, is, uh... Is he going to come? If you let me do my fucking job, you <laughs> You like that? You like that? You fucking maniac? <laughs> you fucking, you want a green goo on my fucking snow white hands, you piece of shit? Yeah, you like that green goo on your little mushroom tip, don't you, you fucking dead guy? Are you talking to him now? Listen! Listen! <laughs>